Hello and welcome back to another part of the Realistic Pro Mod series where I'm trying to be as realistic as possible here. I'm in the job market and we're just about to take that job there. For call where we dropped off last time I'm going to Ostersund in Sweden, 325 miles, frame at 498 in a 430-12 speed Renault Premium. Yes I know it's a premium again but you see job market like it's on the best paying ones per mile and also the paying one now roof decision here because gonna be using maybe the used truck mod in here and there's please a proceed to the highlighted that available route. for ATS that our target is to try and earn around 250,000 in each game and then that would give Wait, it's worth 200 to 250,000, then that gives a chance to get a decent truck in ATS and a trailer as well. We have a retarder in this truck. Turn right. We'll be getting a ferry on this job as well. And yeah, double Inside trailer, we weigh about three right. tons. All together. So these must be very lightweight or bulky items. There will be double trailer and three ton. In 650 feet, turn left. But no changing mods from the last turn video. Turn left. In 650 feet, turn left. Turn left. Uh, yes, that fine we got in the last video that the truck slot just delivered the stomach side of us. We did get the insurance payout on it, so. They submitted the video evidence to them, studied it, and. Then conclusion I did. At the roundabout, take the third exit. Hopefully this journey will go smoothly. One of these drivers that will jump in any truck and go. Right. What the best option for us when we get drop off and go into the job market? I'm not time like from these videos with two or three jobs onto one yet. <coughs> but if I need to, I will. As I was saying, I'm exactly how they happen. I leave everything in, I hide nothing in them. Pines are on, realistic fuel consumption's on, air brakes are on. That's it. I aren't using any enhancements for money or XP on the profile. I'm using more co more more economy. A more economy. It's a mod that's on the Steam Workshop. Takes things down to more realistic level apparently and being an agency driver we get paid next to nothing we're doing the jobs but we're wage slaves at the moment we're not company owner though that will maybe hopefully happen eventually don't know when that will be but it'd be 
maybe when we build up there. It's at about 250,000-ish uh, mark because that will give a truck that's just slightly above entry level both games and enough to buy hopefully we'll get enough to buy our own drive on or in ATS or curtain cider in ATS 2 they're a long way off that yet and this is that the plan may change they want to eventually on all don't know what to do with it kick series or just here's a little video on it I say we're a good bit off that yet because we've only just got this door for 4,000 on this profile and we're earning anything from 2 to 500 at the moment but as our levels increase and we get more loads offered to us the job money does go up a little bit so Don't help is I'm using different economy mods in both games because the same economy mods aren't available that I know of. So I'm using a couple I've tried before on other profiles. Last time I tried the one in 80, I made the mistake of getting loan out and buying truck too early, and I struggled to. Yeah, and ATS too, and I tried them before. Done a few jobs, took the loan out, got a truck and what have you and then I struggled to fuel it and maintain it going along so I was barely making anything doing about 10,000 uh, 5,000 miles or so services and obviously with fuel I was only making about one or two thousand so with loan payments as well so a little bit different this time if we if we succeed if we fail we fail if we fail we'll just stay company driver rather than being a owner operator but yeah. I know there's uh, several surviving shooting series about uh, at the moment as well but I call this survival trucking for reasons every other them about one of them's been genuine and has you understand the game economy and XP one of them did earn enough to get the use truck that's a dagger win and the other one who was doing it that in spell survival right and uh, what have you that one is using XP cheap because you don't get a thousand XP per part of the trailer the maximum you get is 90 uh, next being a slight mini treat on it, so uh, I won't name the other one who's XP cheat yet, but because I know him and I get on with him, but do I like this? I know this isn't a unique uh, new idea with this game, but most things have been done before, so uh, I also recommend anybody who's not familiar with Mr. Doug Sharples is go and check his channel out because occasionally he has a series similar to this. Uh, Sammy Skin Pots is character called and uh, as well around Europe oh, I didn't get any damage there thankfully keep to the right and then turn right Turn right. All of the sat now, but well, I think we could get on and around here. We will be getting the ferry on this journey.
Billy Hughes and Sam told him what the youth are all so far. Let's creep. Well, Creech Band and me, there's some good sound motive is about, but that isn't available for every truck yet. Will he? There will be eventually, and probably use Creech Band sound mode, given when we get our own truck, but that's not possible. <coughs> In 650 feet, turn left. Turn left. <laughs> Navigation resumed. Navigation resumed. Homsund. Yeah, uh, we are going up to. We're going to there eventually. Ostersund. Navigation resumed. Where we'll go from there, I don't know. But we're just having a bit of a tour around for all mods. Navigation resumed. Right, so compulsory control at the daytime in sleep, so we'll obey by that. Very right that one. Billy. Turn right. Before these trucks are underrated, alright, they're not the best in the game, but they're not, they're not that bad. They don't got the gravitas or the style of some of the others, it doesn't make say they're any worse. Do a heaviest load we want and we didn't have any problems. It's a very light load with a double trailer on, so any truck could do this. Quite easily. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Oh, here. Again. Uh. Use the exit ahead. That one might have been my fault, so we'll just let that one go. We'll go with the floor. At the roundabout, take the third exit. On roundabouts in this game, it's having another go, go have another go there. Use the exit ahead. A bit like Russian roulette. 
you do so many and all right and then all of a sudden you get fired into the AI but that's it I've done a lot of miles in this game so <laughs> I just don't do the recording profiles, I have some that do offline as well or I have MP profiles that at the moment that I use for combine with other people and the two of have had some very nice enjoyable convoys with Oddball76 game which he streamed on his channel okay, why I don't stream much now is because if there's some other got ill and the hell bit the worst I can be called away at any time so with the recordings I'll be at the pause and then resume them I started things out down in her house for her she lives in the same street as me but not the same house so dependent I'm trying to put it in for that, and I'm sure that accident was my fault. But blowing my hands up to it. It's a good trip to tell if you've got a pair on or on or not because it, I'll just put it here now. If I put the retarder on, take the blue lights in the grab counter, put the retarder off, and that disappears. Now that's this truck's indication of indicating that the retarder is when you engage it to be on, it's on. Because a lot of trips just don't show an R or a symbol. The roundabout, take the second exit. Navigation resumed. Navigation resumed. Uh, once again, if glorious sat nav. So, properly. Navigation resumed. Go down into here. If possible, please Navigation turn around. Resumed. I've got that on the right, uh, the correct if side possible, of the road. Please turn around. Fine. So. Navigation resumed. Do this. Probably could have gone out with Willie's there, but that's the name of the company. That I'm not being rude. Turn left. At all before anybody accuses me of it. You may get occasional bad language on, on the hit in these videos as you've heard so previously. So in try, 650 feet, turn right. Try to limit it. Turn right. At the roundabout, take the first exit. Use the exit ahead.
my out to them again. Got some more in packet anyway. The roundabout, take the first exit. Okay, get uh, another roundabout dance, is it with AI? Go on, Mr. Weird, whatever you tell to me. Just get out and go and have a walk up there. Go over that driver. The driver, see what they're doing. Alright, pal, you can go. If you go with your doors are on. If I had the mouse set up right, this would work brilliantly, but it hasn't. Anyway. Well, we'll try and, uh, I was going to try and do that, but uh, to be crafty with your mouse screen now, can we get around them in any way? We can't. Risky manoeuvre. Oh. Clear the cells eventually out there. Use the exit ahead. Get around in before he moves. Traffic action around the road event there. No way. I'm gonna come up the pavement and try and get around the outside of them there, but against that. And the cursor speed so fast on the what are you flying speed so fast or walking speed whatever what we call it. Still left to do, I know. Be dragging this job, but it's just the nature of the game. Well, we're down to 40.
Gary Walter Weavers are wandering willies today. Both of them are the main thing it's a uh, took out AI vehicle goes in one lane into the other then crosses the way back in the other mm. when there's actually no obvious need for him to do it that's why I call them wandering willies or Walter Weavers depending if I want to be polite. That's so my little thank you too there, because if it's a long one I'm angry. If I'd kept going, he would have kept going. So if I stopped, he stopped. Mm. Yeah, no bother, like that. That was like that. Some of these recording on a different day to the ATS one now, so can't get able to get some built up. But I have to record on the Data Z drop of ATS two. When I start re recording on the drop, I'll have done the Data Z of ATS on the Volvo Reaper. Done that because. Still got a few videos to upload, but nothing made after that for maybe a second season of that. Slow down, we'll be taking right. another one out of that city in the following video to this one. Use the right exit ahead. Don't know what truck it is yet or where we're going because obviously I haven't been not there yet, but that's at the roundabout, the take the first exit. But it won't be back to Cockler, that's about one guarantee and maybe if we give a may not. Use the exit ahead. Sun's well. Very laggy here, but it does has been. Pro, pro, 
very not pro no sorry pro mods get me words out there which I do occasionally but you haven't noticed it too much Figure out the game, it's on it feels in a sale and it, all about DLCs and I recommend that just have them. Not try to draw more to sell this pay. It works out to under one British pound to, to buy the pit version. You can download it for free, limited on download speed and how many parts download it once before you download it all in one file? You pay about a euro and it's a lot quicker download as well. Keep to the right and then oh, turn right. You get some hours and hours and hours of enjoyment on the map. It's lying different turn areas. Right. There's no particular right and wrong way to play this game as long as you deliver your load from A to B. Whether you just stay on a strata and quick jobs, like a setup, or it would be quick on real life, or the release, you can take the bank loan out, buy your own truck, customize it, or you can do quick jobs. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Jobs, it or it to work. Until you get enough Use to the exit buy your own truck, then go exploring. Now, do that. Take your stand cook jobs wherever if you want to. Like, get your own truck trail, go around the map, just yourself, and not. Or, you can start up with yourself, then you can, if you've got the garage space to do it, buy other trucks, maybe trailers, and hire Use the right lane ahead. drivers so you start to a business that way. It's your game, you make up it as what you want, but the principle of it is you'll be driving anywhere. Set the load from A to B. There's some lovely areas in Europe. I know you can get the Russian maps and things and other maps to add on to so what's what the draw ones for now. And base game. But try this game for yourself is if you haven't got it, is you, I recommend you get the demo, alright, it's not a full place latest version demo, what you get. It has some of the features limited in it, but it will give you some idea of what the game's like and what you can do with it. Manager. 
If I had any all taken out, I should involve you. the things are at the moment with it but I keep picking on the bar of the marmots and and the workshop things the workshops good for you saw some mods do a street of the papers reviews or stuff and then subscribe to the mod you know it's effectively downloaded it yeah implement it Activate it into your game and it should back into your game. Some mods work better than others, but it's just gone there, especially if you're combining mods. What works with what? You get everything on the workshop from body chucks, paint jobs, trailers, cargoes. My interface is things about the game economy, graphics, all good stuff. And all well, those additional tuning parts for some of the trucks. But put mods in, bearing in mind that if you use truckers, then if you go on the multiplayer, you cannot use any mods on there. That what's allowed, like pro mods, is allowed on there. Dash mods aren't sound mods aren't and no there's mods where you can get muddy trailers and things and uh like 730 or 750 oh, scan your old Volvo and you need any truck you can get that and sing Use the right lane ahead. You have a multi player but you have to activate them on single player first. On that profile. So we've got 70 mile left now. So we're on the home stretch of this run. Renault, well we've got Renault 498 which actually it will Bouncer in reality, we are only 158 for this job because we've had a 340 euro fine to pay. It wouldn't be one of our videos without fighting, would it, or anything? So, at the roundabout, take the first exit. Use the exit ahead. set the game up, you pick your start and sit there, you pick your truck, what you're going to like, right lane ahead. and you pick your start and sit the where you start from. The first job you do is in the truck of your choice, that you picked, got the range on, no mileage on it, etc. And then when it comes time where you Truck it shows you in the nearest ticket with a dealer in. In oh, the brand feet, you've chosen. Right. Now, so if you're starting Glasgow on this one, turn right. It will give you the. You have arrived at your destination. Dealer. Probably Aberdeen. You went down that road. Like that's an example. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, I'm gonna run a long journey and uh, I'm gonna double trailer. I'm not gonna do parking them. Yeah, so that concludes that one for now. So next time we shall be picking it hopefully Ostersund. What you know where to, I don't know yet. So anyway, content for now. Stay safe and roll until many accidents and bye. Bye. Next time. Bye.